Hello friends, this is Scott, and today is July 14th, and I'm checking on the progress of the peppers I planted in the two earth boxes that I've had for many, many years. Again, I always plant my peppers in these because they, they always seem to do better. I get really, really good harvest. Uh, again, not organic. Uh, you could try to make them organic, but kind of defeats the purpose of the earth box. But that's my first of the ahi amarillo peppers. Looks like it's doing well. And I'll swing through here and see what other kind of peppers are. Some flowering. And what do I have in here? Let's see. Looks like those, I don't know if those are jalapenos or if those are those uh, Pablo Serranos or whatever they call them. I have to wait till they get a little bit bigger and see the color of them. And then looking in through here, it looks like it's hard to see. Those are little Thai chilies, the ones that are sticking up instead of sticking down. So we're going to have some Thai chilies. I don't know how hot those are going to be, but I think they're going to be pretty, pretty warm. As I scan back here, I find a couple... Let's see, I, find, I think I find a couple that's a little bit closer or a little bit easier to see. Oh, there's a couple right there. It gets a little blurry, but those are Thai chilies. So I'm excited to try those and see how, uh, see how they burn our mouths. But overall, the peppers are doing great in the earth boxes. And what I like about these is once they're already set up, and I'm going to link the other videos uh, that I've done on this subject in the comments, but the only maintenance you do is you fill the water up with the, from the fill tubes and you just wait till you see water coming out the hole on the side there and you know you've uh, you've filled it up and you don't over water because it, uh, it'll just drain out so I'll fill this other tube and let's see how we do here how much water these need it's been very very hot uh, so we'll see how uh, how much water these need I watered them yesterday and uh, it's been a little bit rainy but it uh, looks like they don't need much today so so that's good now, and usually I only water them every two or three days. That's usually the, the routine. But they're doing great, and we should have lots of peppers. So here we go, earth box peppers. I think it's a great way to grow them, and uh, they always do well. So thanks for watching this video, and if you want to continue to follow me on my process of living my best rural life in the city, and now in the small town on the hobby farm, as well as the school garden, uh, please... Watch my channel and hit the subscribe button, like, share, and comment as I'd love to hear from you. Thank you.